Yo, what up? What's poppin'? Back at it again with another video for y'all. Just want to chat with y'all, give y'all some more advice, give y'all some heads up, and, you know, give y'all some motivation. And what I want to discuss with y'all about is movies and TV shows. Now, with all the stuff that has been going on, that has happened, Kobe Bryant passed away in a helicopter crash, the pan the the pandemic had first hit everybody had to like stay stuck in their homes people were bored in the house people didn't really know what they were gonna do by being being stuck in the house all day people so used to 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 leave in the house what I'm what I want to discuss with y'all about is that when it comes down to these movies and these TV shows these cartoons They've actually put some messages, they, they put some hidden messages in movies and TV shows and cartoons to the point where a lot of people just become programmed to it, you know, like b b b b before it even happens. And when it does happen, they'll just reminisce about it and say like they've, they've seen it on this movie, they've seen it on this TV show, they've seen it on this cartoon, just like... You know, like I said, with politics, like at the time when Barack Obama when, when Barack Obama was running for president, he was going up against John McCain. Now, I don't know if y'all are familiar with the show The Boondocks, but there was an episode of The Boondocks where they pretty much predicted Barack Obama becoming the first black president of the United States. The Boondocks pretty much predicted it. You know they they be having hidden miss hidden messages in these movies and in the and in and in the and in these TV shows. You know to to program people. And I know some people may think that the stuff is a conspiracy, but unfortunately, it's not a conspiracy. It's not a conspiracy. And I know some of you may look at it as being scary, but the same stuff has been happening for years and for years and for years. You know, what I mean, you know, people just become programmed, you know, to, you know, the stuff that they see on these TV shows and on these movies. You know, some of these movies actually be showing how stuff is going to go down in the years. They even be they even be putting hidden messages in, in, in some of these video games. You know, what I mean. But yeah, I mean, we you know, the, the, the world that we're living in and, and, and then like. A lot of these parents are like frustrated about their kids being, you know, falling behind in school. Like, like I said before, I, I don't think school is ever going to be the same. You know, the world is changing, you know, you know, school, it seems like school is never going to be the same. You know, with, 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 with a lot of these jobs, people working from home. These jobs are probably not even going to be the same. You're probably not even going to have any more workers. You know, they're going to be having robots doing a lot of these jobs. People really need to start waking up out here and finding out what it is that they want to do. Because I know I know that there's like a lot of people out here that are just like at a low vibration, you know, by by the stuff that like they see on TV. Like they they think that like it's a conspiracy it's not a conspiracy with with these movies and with these TV shows and cartoons, the hidden messages that they put in the stuff. It, it, unfortunately, it's the real duel. You know, it, it, it's, it's the real duel. You know, it, it, it's, it's just made to get you programmed, you know, before the stuff even happens. And, and, and it's like being in this world, it's almost like, they won't even, like, let us live, you know what I mean? You know, they they, they, they always want to, like, program us. They want us to, like, be stuck in the box. You know, it's, it's almost like they won't even, like, let us live. Because just, like, on some episodes of The Simpsons, like, they, they predicted Kobe Bryant passing away in a helicopter crash. And then they also pretty much had hidden messages about the school system and how, you know, school is, 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 is like a waste of time. You know what I mean? Like I said, nobody is a failure in school.
nobody. It doesn't matter how many tests you flunked. It doesn't matter how many F, Fs you got on your report card, on your interim report. You're not a failure. You know, you're not a failure. So hold your head up high because you're not a failure. But yeah, and, and, and even for the kids, yeah, with, with, with this, with this CVID stuff still going on for the kids that are in school right now, you know, I mean, if, 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 you're, if you're watching this video or if parents are watching this video and, and they're worried about their child, tell your, your child that they're not a failure. Tell your child that they're destined for success. You know, like I said, parents, I'm going to keep on saying this and I'm going to say this again. You got to make sure that your child's mental health is in check. School is not the place for their mental health. It's just not it. But, yo, yeah, you know, I mean, I, you know, I just wanted to do this video with y'all because like with these movies and with these TV shows, you know, they pretty much predict, you know, how stuff really go, you know, really goes, what's, what's really gonna go down in the world, you know, I mean, just like, you know, like I said, that episode of the Boondocks, they pretty much predicted Barack Obama becoming the first black president of the United States of America, and, and, and that's the thing about it, in the black community, a lot of people voted for, a lot of black people voted for Barack Obama just because he was black, like I said before, I understand history. I understand there's never been a black president. And I also understand that back in the day with the civil rights movement, with the Jim Crow laws in the South, I understand that blacks didn't have the option to vote. I get that. That's definitely understandable. I understand that our ancestors fought hard for that. But at the end of the day, I mean, just because somebody is the same race as you are does not mean that y'all are going to do good business together. See, this is something that we need to do better with in the black community because we can do good business together. You know, by, 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 pe by, by black people voting for Barack Obama, you know, they were supporting him. You know, they, they, they understood history. They knew that there, there was never a black president. But at the same time, I mean, you can't just pick someone out for a job just because they're the same race as you are like if you're trying to start up a business and you're trying to get some partners you can't just pick this this person and that person just because they're the same race as you are you got to really see you got to really see the people who really have a good work ethic who's who's down who, who who's willing to succeed you know who 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 is on the same path with you because not yeah, just because they're the same race as you are does not mean that they're on they're on the same path with you. Sometimes just because y'all are the same race, they may be trying to break you down. But yeah, I mean, in the black community, we don't gotta break each other down. We can build each other up. We can support one another. We can become partners. We can own businesses together. We can do this. But people just don't really want to gain knowledge. People think a lot of this stuff is just a conspiracy it's not it's, you know there, there's hidden messages in these movies and in these tv shows you know people don't even really like know about it because they think it's a conspiracy but yeah i just wanted to share this video with y'all give y'all some tips some advice you know, a heads up, because there are TV shows and there are movies that pretty much predict how stuff is going to go down in the world. Don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell on my channel, comment, share, love y'all.